So, Kelvin, what is the uh, excitement level to be, I guess, I was going to say back in this gym, but you'll be in a new gym tomorrow. So what's the, the excitement level just to get this started um, after the offseason and all the additions you guys have had in the offseason? Um, can y'all hear me? Yeah. Uh, I'm definitely excited. Um, you know, we get we go into a new building, um, start a fresh leaf, and uh, we know we're ready to work. We've been working all summer. And um, I, I feel like for us, training camp is just going to be another day. We've been going hard for 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 more more than half the summer. So um, it's nothing special. We're going to come in tomorrow ready to work, uh, locked in as, as always, and, you know, we get some stuff done. What have those open gym runs been like in terms of both building camaraderie and then learning how to play with each other and, and all that stuff? Uh, it's been competitive. You know, we've been getting after each other, um, you know, Really, really, just competing. I feel like um, it, this has been a, one of the best open gyms I've been a part of since I've been since San Spur. So, you know, I'm excited for, for for not only me but the whole entire group. Kelvin, over here to your right. When it comes to this year, Pop was mentioning how there's kind of a feeling of of learning. Yeah, everybody's got to develop. Everybody's going to learn. What do you think are parts of your game that? maybe you're eager to develop a little bit more or things that you want to learn a little bit if that that's working with the guys what are you what's got you excited about learning this year um you know i'm always excited to learn as a player i feel like um you know for me i feel like just just showing showing uh i feel like you guys that i can defend um i feel like uh, i'm an elite defender i feel like that um and that's the part of my game I feel like that uh, I'm ready to show off, show off to you guys. Um, I feel like I've grown a lot this summer. I put a lot of hard work and time in to, 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 to my body and, and my craft and basketball. Uh, so I'm ready. You know, I'm ready. I'm excited to, you know, show all the doubters, prove all the doubters wrong. Uh, for lack of a better word, the, the circus that comes with someone like Victor Wembanyama. How did the rest of you all keep that in check, accept it, move, you know, work around it? What what mindset do you all have to have to, to make it work? Um, I mean, Vic's such a humble kid. Like, we don't – I mean, I feel like personally um, we don't really – you know, that really doesn't affect us. Like, I feel like uh, Vic is so humble. He doesn't let any any of the, the hype or the media uh, – coming to his life or, or I feel like affect him as a person. He's been, um, I mean, he's been outgoing, humble, great, energetic, um, playful. You know, he's, he's, been, he's been great. So, you know, all the, all the other things that, that come with, you know, Vic being an amazing basketball player, um, you know, we, we kind of just keep down the outside. Hey, Kelly, y'all, as a team, y'all didn't get a lot of attention, you know, last couple of years. This year, all the national television appearances and all the attention, is that something you all are eager to kind of show people what you all have here? Uh, definitely. I feel like, um, you know, we've been, we've been slept on. We, we, we uh, you know, in a sense, like I feel like we've been overlooked uh, as far as saying we don't have, we don't have good talent. But um, I feel like we put in a lot of hard work. And at the end of the day, you know, once we get out there on the court, uh, can't no media outlet play for us. Um, can't no coach play for us, and uh, I feel like when we look to the left and the right, I'm, I'm pretty comfortable, you know, with, with, with who I have going going to war for me each and every night. So I'm excited. Um, I feel like my teammates are excited, and, and we're ready to, you know, stir some things up. Kelvin, over here to your uh, to your left. Would going back to those open runs, what has that been like having the majority, if not everybody, being able to to get on the court and play with each other during these open runs so far? Uh, it's definitely big, you know. Um, you know, it's been some tough days. It's been some good days, bad days, but you know that's what comes with growing with a with a new group and, and having new pieces around. But um, we we definitely had everybody here, so I feel like um, you know we we had a grasp of, of what's everybody's tendencies, what they like to do, what they what they don't like to do. So going into the season, it's not just starting from from ground zero. Uh, you know, starting tomorrow. Hey, Keldon, uh, how does the addition of the in-season tournament change what you guys do uh, over the course of the season, and what are your expectations for that? Are you looking forward to it? Does it change what you're looking forward to take out of this season? Uh, we plan on winning. I feel like uh, that's our mindset going into the season. 
Um, I feel like we're not approaching it any different than we would approach any other game. We want to go out there and win, um, and, and you know, hopefully, hopefully compete, compete. And uh, I think it's Las Vegas, right? So I mean, that's our mindset. I mean, we want to win, we want to compete, and um, we're gonna grow as a team. Keldon, uh, following the, the the Dejounte trade last summer. You and guys like Devin were thrust into sort of this leadership role. Devin missed a whole bunch of the season. Uh, what did you learn about yourself as an offensive player, defensive player, whatever, in, in such a big role that you hadn't been accustomed to prior? I mean, you just got to adjust. I, I, I knew that nobody would feel sorry um, for, for the role that, that, that I was in. And, um, you know, like you said, unfortunately, we, we had some injuries. Um, but... Um, you know, I just just kept grinding. You know, I, I grew as a leader. You know, through the thick and thin of, of, of the season, and um, you know, I just continue to you know work hard. I feel like um, you know, I, le- I learned that I, I I can do it. That you know, that, that I can compete at a high level each and every night. Kellen, coach talk, talked about last year being a development year, and this year he, he's expecting some wins. What do you see from this team? That leads you to believe that that y'all can attain that. Um, I mean, we fight. You know, we got that grit. Uh, we hungry, um, and, and, and realistically, like we 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 know we are expected to win this year. Like we we want to win. It's not. Uh, we don't want to hear we're growing or, or that you know we're young. We we want to win. We're going out there to win every game this season. So, um, you know, we're going out there to compete and, and get out the guys. Keldon over here. How's it going? Good, good. What's it feel like to know that you're one of the longest tenured spur on this roster and that role as far as, and also too, just those experiences this team learned last year. You know, a lot of losses, but that's a big amount of experience heading into this new season. Um, it's definitely, I feel like it's crazy. Um, I feel like I was just one of the young guys on the team, but um, it's definitely, you know, a turn of events, but, you know, um, in the long season last year, you know, this season, you got our eyes for it and uh, ready to compete. Kelton, last year you started the season shooting really hot, and then as the season went on, you, your game sort of transitioned to more attacking the basket. Offensively, where are you trying to fit in this year, and where do you feel like your body is uh, in terms of weight, strength, uh, agility, as you try to achieve those things? As um, far as strength, strength and size-wise, I feel like... Um, you know, this this is one of the best. Like, this is the best I I, I felt as far as balance wise. I feel like with being weight and, and with like having the right weight and, and being strong at the same time. Um, far as you know, offensively, you know, I just I just play the game of basketball. Whatever the defense gives me, um, you know, that's what I take. Um, I continue to shoot the ball. I continue to drive the ball, and um, you know, you just got to continue to make great decisions. So. Offensively, I'll let it come. Whatever, whatever my team needs me to uh, be on offensively, that's what I'll be. And, um, you know, we have so many great players that, you know, any night it could be somebody different. So um, that's the exciting thing about having a young, young, great team. And, um, you know, I'm looking forward to that. Hey, Kelden, even with the loss, it seemed like Coach uh, Pop enjoyed the development and the growth. Uh, do you kind of get a sense of that this year as well? Do you sense kind of an excitement with them or? Uh, he's always excited. I feel like um, I wish you guys could be around him. Uh, he's always smiling and joking around. But, um, you know, he's excited. You know, you can see it in his face that, you know, he's, he's ready for us to, to kick it off and get going. And uh, just so happened that that day is tomorrow. So we're going to lock in and get ready to learn and work and um, be ready to go out there and compete uh, when the ball goes up. No problem. Y'all have a great day. Hello, everybody. Stefania Jimenez here. Thank you so much for watching KSAT's YouTube channel. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.